what's up what's up welcome back to the channel this is free city tv and we are here to update you on another entertainment news don't forget to like comment and subscribe down below we've all seen on social media that one man named mr choppinson or say choppinson claiming that shatawali is owing him over a video shoot and other projects sammy flex who is shatawali's manager has come out with evidence and even the guy's passport where they paid for the guy's flight to tamale and a whole lot of things in it you won't waste your time but mr choppinson claims shatawali owes him for some amount of money and sammy flex but also detailed what is in it i assume the position it wasn't too long ago when this gentleman started calling me of course to guess a sammy flex number is not very difficult if you want it so he started calling me described himself as sir choppinson oh the moment he mentioned his name i knew him so i said oh, oh okay choppinson yes 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 and um he told me oh, he was working with shatawale and because of this and that um he had to go but he he has felt or he's feeling that all those things that happened he felt sorry about it and now he wants to come back and work with Shatawale again. That's how he started all these things. In fact, when he said to me first, I was even not willing to go approach Shata to have that discussion with him. But I can tell you, for over a month, this gentleman was on my neck. To the people who work with me in my studio, they might have seen him a couple of times maybe before we started working. Like almost every week, he will come to my office. Every week, back course there, oh, a thousand times. Every week you come to my office. First, so one day when I presented the issue of his desire to come back to work with the Empire to Shata Wale, Shata Wale told me that no, he doesn't want to work with him. In fact, that was his first response. No, I don't want to work with him. And that he knows him. He doesn't have the kind of character that he would want to work with because of what he's done in the past. So he's gone. I told him this, that Charlie. I've spoken about you coming back to the empire, but looks like it's not working. So let's see what will happen next. He keeps pressuring. Then, as much as he keeps pressuring, and because I was also looking for um, someone to start working with, once again, I still persisted. Um, went to Shatawale again and tried to put in a word or two. He was still insisting. He said no. Then I told him that, okay, give me the chance to work with him and not you working with him i am going to deal directly with him he's not going to have any dealings or whatsoever with you because i want to hit the road running i want to get some videos going so as much as you don't want to work with him give me the chance to deal with him so that at least in terms of how much i'm going to pay him what we are supposed to do what we have to get and all those things i am going to take care of it he was still not too comfortable but he said well he doesn't want to prolong it. If I am sure I can handle him, then that's fine. Because he doesn't want to deal with it. In fact, he was specific. He doesn't want to deal with him. I said, well, he should give me the chance that I will deal with him. Then he said, okay, if I say I want to deal with him, that is fine. Now, someone should check. Kill a Jimmy video. How long has it been? Maybe less than two weeks. Maybe two weeks as we speak. Maybe less than two, maybe two weeks as we speak. Now, this man was not talking to me. He was only talking to Shatawali. A time came that I had to do some list for us to travel to London. We were supposed to go to London. Maybe I'll talk about that some in the near future. We were supposed to go to London like 10th July or something like that. Shata told me I should add him. I should add his PA. I should add his stylist. Myself and him as the artist. I should put this thing together. I put the thing together. In fact, some of them have even submitted their visas already i work permit visas already you chop is now added you because even though you were not talking to me even though you were having an issue with me i still did not mind because talent is work me i have strong emotions when it comes to work i don't let my emotions take a better part of me with work i'm always being professional with work i added you you were having communications or oh, bring your date of birth and you see when i was calling him to ask him about um the video when he's going to finish there he was not minding me but when i started sending give me your passport give me your details give me your this fill this form for me that one day anytime i send it to him he would respond anytime i sent it he would respond until we got to where he was supposed to provide his permit unfortunately for my man and all of us never knew about this until recently 
he doesn't have like a permit to stay in Ghana. He doesn't have um, how do we go? Okay, maybe let me use the term there. Work permit. He doesn't have the work permit to work here in Ghana. So that particular portion in his form because he's using Nigerian passport. So if he has to submit any visa application from here, he needs a stay permit. A permit that allow that shows that he is staying here in Ghana and he's working in Ghana. He did not have all those things. Yet we were still trying to work it out.